Well, hey guys, what's going on? Jamie here. Just want to do a quick video for Quicksilver and really go into why gold buys silver now. Um, of course, there's been a lot of different reasons to get into precious metals. We've talked about it on this channel for several years now, but why now, um, April 2023, now would be a good time to get into precious metals. Let's go ahead and cover it. Of course, I want to start off by saying that I am not a financial advisor. Ever take anything I say as financial advice. If you're looking for financial advice, you should seek out a licensed professional. I'm just a guy on YouTube showing you what I'm doing in a different platforms that I'm in to create residual income and stack assets. So Quicksilver, guys, we've talked about this at length. This has been a platform that I've been in for a couple of years, since 2019. And uh, yeah, it's been a great, great ride. If for anything else, if you you know, perhaps don't want to build a network marketing business or build a home-based business. Um, some of you guys might be in the market to maybe just stack gold and silver, precious metals. Um, and really why now would be a good time, as you guys probably know, or maybe not, maybe if you watch the news or not, but there are some countries that are moving away from the U.S. dollar. They're looking to create their own currency. They're banding together to... Um, you know, move, move away from, from uh, having the U.S. dollar as a world currency. Now, again, I'm not going to go into politics and, you know, what's right, what's wrong. That's not what I do on this channel. Uh, but, you know, you do need to know what's going on in the world and pay attention because when uh, people or when countries move away from the dollar, um, maybe not overnight, but the dollar will go down in value, right? Um, dollar will go down in value. And when the dollar goes down in value, you got to look at what assets can you get into that historically have gone up in value when the dollar goes down. So if you look at Google right here, it says here, uh, if US, I just typed in, if USD goes down, will gold and silver go up? And it says here, when the dollar exchange rates drop, the cost of gold and silver goes up. Investors tend to shy away from gold and silver when the dollar is high because they will get less for their money. But again, vice versa, when the dollar is low, they start to, um, you know, the, the 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 cost of gold and silver go up. If I scroll down a little bit more, it says here, does gold go up if the U.S. dollar goes down? There are many factors that influence the price of the metal uh, because gold is generally dollar dominated, denominated. A stronger U.S. dollar tends to drive gold prices lower and vice versa. So that means a weaker U.S. dollar tends to drive gold prices up. So, you know, with what's going on in the world, you know, I'm, again, I'm not predicting or I'm not doom and gloom or, you know, trying to give you FUD or anything like that. But if the dollar goes down, you want to hedge yourself and be in a position to stack gold and silver because historically it's gone up when the dollar goes down. So you look over here and you can look at some of the different products that we have. Again, we have gold, we have silver, um, silver bullion, right? I believe we have numismatic coins as well, but I don't really go into to, uh, too many num numismatics. I do have them, uh, but for the most part, I collect silver bullion and gold, right? Um, so you can see here, uh, let's say we just check out the gold items. Um, here's a, a one-fourth gram of gold. Okay, these are smaller denominations, so you can get, get yourself some gold. Of course, we have, you know, the bigger denominations, like one-tenth of an ounce. Um, you can see right here, we have, uh, let me see if I go down to uh, gold. Let me, let me, let me go into silver real quick. So we go to one ounce silver coins. Here we have different, um, you know, different collectibles here. China Panda, Great Britain. But if you just want to get silver eagles, like I'm a I'm a big, a big collector of silver eagles, you can do that as well. So again, if you don't want to build out the network or build residual income, um, and you just want to stack gold and silver, now would probably be a good time to do that. Of course, we do have a business opportunity attached to this because, you know, if there is a, uh, you know, if, if inflation does spike, you know, down the road, and you know people are struggling. Uh, what better way to, you know, what, what better position to be in to not only stack gold and silver, but increase your income, right? Increase your income. So you could have a side hustle, a side gig to keep doing what you're doing, but have a side gig 
that allows you to make residual income from home. And you can check all of this out. I have a video you can check out. Check out the link down below. But yeah, I just want to do a quick video just to kind of show you, um, again, for me, for many years, long before I got into this platform, I was already stacking gold and silver. Uh, but I've been in this platform since 2019. And uh, why I think now would be a great time to get into Quicksilver. All right, guys, that's it for this video, guys. Again, not a financial advisor. Do your own research and due diligence. And uh, yeah, I will catch you on the next video. Peace.